Hey, what's up guys, Jay Zab here, and today we're gonna be opening these three stacking tins. So these tins actually used to have evolving skies in them. Now I believe they have two packs of Silver Tempest and one pack of Lost Origin. So we're gonna open these three and see if that's the case. And then if it is, we're gonna try and pull some awesome cards from it. What do you think? If you like content like this, consider subscribing to the channel. It's free for you and it helps me out immensely. So thanks in advance for that. I really do appreciate it. And without further ado, let's get opening. Hey guys, don't forget, every Friday I give away two JZab mystery packs to two lucky subscribers. So this week is no different. If you want to check out um, what video you have to comment on, check out this video right here. And then the next coming up Friday here, I will be giving away two uh, mystery packs. So stay tuned and hopefully you win. G good luck. And uh, now back to your regularly scheduled program. All right, we're gonna we're gonna go. I'm gonna open grass, then electric, then water. We'll stack these up. They're stackable, right? Uh, yeah. Like I said, um, these used to have evolving skies in them. That's why I used to buy them all the time, and uh, now they do not. So I don't remember where I got these from. I want to say Best Buy. I think I got them from Best Buy. Anywho, let's see. What do we got? Ooh, I think I was right. Yep, Lost Origin, Silver Tempest, Silver Tempest. And then we get a coin. A little Charizard coin, not too shabby. And then, yeah, like I said, um, put that over there. Two Silver Tempest and a Lost Origin ain't shabby. It ain't bad, I don't mind it. And we're gonna open the Silver Tempest first and then the Lost Origin, we're using the, we're using, we're opening, <laughs> wow. The Alolan Vulpix second because if you want if you need to know anything about silver tempest you need to know that there's always hits in the alolan vulpix always and when i say always i mean sometimes and when i say sometimes i mean uh just sometimes so you know uh just take that for what it is i just i feel like i always get hits out of the alolan vulpix packs so yeah pikachu noibat Verizian wireless Noivern There you go, see? And it's because I opened that one first Alright, 50-50 chance if there's a hit in here, right? Technically, statistics, I don't know how they work But, um uh, We'll see, we'll see if what I'm saying is correct Are there hits in the Vulpix packs? What do you think? Take a guess What do you, you tell me down below what, do you, what are you guessing on this first pack? Think there's a hit? You think there's not a hit? I think there's a hit. I think there's a hit because I want there to be a hit. I'm trying to manifest some good cards out of this pack. I don't I don't know what I'm saying or doing. All right, uh, unidentified fossil, Chimcho, Phoebus, Venikin, Spinarark, Beldum, Vulpix, and not a hit. What did I? like glitter on me well there you go i proved myself wrong how about that all right we got a couple of these packs to get through uh hopefully we could get some hits out of these you know silver tempest they kind of started putting that in everything i think there must have been a massive reprint and um because it's super cheap or it was or is i don't know i haven't really looked in a minute because i bought a lot of it so i haven't really been looking to open any silver tempest but uh these stacking tins were like a crazy good deal and i don't remember most of the time that's why i buy stuff like this i don't i knew that there wasn't going to be evolving skies in here i just bought it because um you know i it was a deal go let's go all right first hit of the day kyurum v max this card's sick by the way i love it i love it it's got a cough that's why it's so sick <laughs> you hear that that's that Kyurem. <laughs> uh, yeah, this card's amazing. I like I like Kyurem. Oh, this is kind of in my way. Um, and the VMAX, I love the rainbows. I love the rainbows in the background. The texture is fantastic. The swirlies in the background of the card are fantastic. So I'll take that all day. Thank you very much. First tin down, not bad. One hit out of the tin. That's not too terrible. Oh, here we go. Let's see what else we got. Going electric neck. 
And you know, somebody did ask me uh, a while ago what the the numbers on the b bottom of this one. Here, let's take a look together. Look, just E23. Not that you can like tell because you know you have to open it to be able to look at the bottom. But still, I guess I, I guess it's good to know. Uh, yep. So, ooh, Sir Fetched coin instead. I like Sir Fetched. Uh, and then we got another Alolan Vulpix. What do you think this time? Am, am I gonna be right? One of these times I'm gonna be right. About the hits. Yeah, we're gonna do the same thing. Same thing, same order, same pack selection. This Silver Tempest, these packs are actually feel like quality. Like the actual sleeve. Feels like... Good. You know, sometimes you open these packs and the... It feel like brittle. I think the brittle ones are the older ones, and these ones that feel a little bit more sturdy, I feel like are newer runs. And that's what I'm saying. There was a, there had to have been a um, reprint of Silver Tempest, and they just started putting it in everything. Because it's just it is in everything. Sunflora, especially like those heavy hitter boxes. Um, they started pumping those full of Silver Tempest. These these um, stacking tins. I'm trying to think what else. The, I, I got some ETBs of Silver Tempest at a crazy good deal. Um, so, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, to per the time of me recording this video, there's still booster boxes of Silver Tempest available on Pokemon Center. So. Sandy Gast. Relicanth. Alucha, Rufflet, Vulpix. Yo, okay, I didn't even realize first. It took my brain like half a second to catch up. Let's go. I'll take a Radiant Alkazam all day, every day. Radiant cards are amazing. I love the hatching. I love the textures. See that in the Pokemon? <sighs> so good, so clean, so fantastic. And I'll take a hit. That was in the Alolan Vulpix pack, by the way. So 50-50. <laughs> I'm 50% of the time I'm right. You know, 50% um, of the time it works every time. You know? Alright, not bad, not bad. Let's hope that our Lost Origin could give us a hit. Uh, I want to open a ton more Lost Origin, but it's expensive. Lost Origin sold out at MSRP booster boxes, and now it's kind of hard to find Lost Origin. You can still find ETBs for like reasonably priced, 32 bucks at the cheapest, which isn't too bad, but because they don't come with the nine packs in them, they only come with the eight packs, it's kind of a little rough, you know? Yes! Yo! Misfortune Sisters Rainbow, look at the textures on that card. <sighs> Whoa, okay, let's go. What are these? Tins just got fantastic hits in all of the Lost Origin or what? This is a card I know for a fact I have not pulled yet. That is phenomenally great. I love everything about it. Okay, I'm a little, um, I'm a little dumbstruck there. That was, that was not expected. And the card is just clean. Everything about it is fantastic. If, if you didn't know, I'm a fan of the full art trainer cards. And I know that's not technically a, a full art trainer card, but that's basically what it is. And, uh, yeah, that's just a good card. That's just good, clean, quality fun right there is what that is. All right, last tin. Still the same packs. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. No Alolan Vulpix. And another Charizard coin. So, very cool. And we can stack that up. I feel like these tins are now, like, creating a shadow on my... I'm gonna, I'm gonna move them. Alright, well, let's hope that the Lost Origin, uh... Has another hit. If we get another Lost Origin hit, that would be ridiculous. That would be ridiculous. Alright, but Silver Tempest could use a little hits as well. We've gotten a Radiant Alkazam. Not bad by any means, but when um, there was those collector's chests, those god pack collector chests going around, I opened quite a few of them, and there was a lot of Radiant Alkazams in those packs. So, 
I want to say conservatively now with that one, I want to say I have seven or eight Radiant Alakazams. And I think that's underselling it. <laughs> Silver Tempest. Doo -doo 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 I've been uh, humming and singing a lot today. I don't know why. Don't know why. Some days are just like that, you know? You just kind of, you feeling it, feeling it, and then you just kind of go for it. All right, last chance for Silver Tempest to really wow us. Let's see. Let's see what happens. I I feel like it's got, it has to wow me right now. Silver Tempest, I've been opening a good amount because I've, you know, had it because it's cheap. And it hasn't been wowing me. So let's wow me here. Okay, that's a way to do it. <laughs> that is a way to wow me. Look at that Braxton, Bra Braxton, Braxton, Braxton. That's pretty dope trainer gallery card, I gotta say. I do enjoy it quite a bit. All good stuff right there. Quality, family fun right there. And uh, there's a chance for a double banger. What is it? Oh, <laughs> yeah, it is a double banger. Nice. We got the Ursa Luna V, the Braxton trainer gallery. Guys, Silver Tempest kind of brought out the big guns there at the end. Very nice. Double banger, two hits. Ursaloon is pretty cool. It's like breaking through some ice or something. Here these chunks are. That's pretty dope. All right. Uh, good. Good stuff. All right. And then let's see. If this Lost Origin has a hit in it, then maybe these tins are broken. Because that would be three. That would be three hits out of three tins. Let's find out together. Here we go. All right, Lost Origin. Can you give us three out of three? That ride on is fantastic. So many, so much good artwork in Lost Origin. You know, no wonder it's such a quality set. And the chase cards are just fantastic. I love them. Squo vet and ah no 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 no. Okay. All right. Hey, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, give me a second here. Let me clean this up real quick. All right, guys, here are our polls from today. The best, the, my favorite. This card's amazing. Leaves me tongue tied. I love it. And then, uh, I don't know. I think actually the next favorite one would probably be the Kyurum. And then the Double Banger was pretty good. I enjoyed those cards. And the Radiant Alakazam is cool too. So, um, not too shabby. When the nine packs open, we got five hits. I'd call that a win in my book. So. I had a good time. I hope you did too. If you did, give the video a like, subscribe to the channel. If you want to subscribe, you can press this little button right here. It will subscribe you to my channel. And then I'm going to put two videos up top here. If you like the content, go check out some more. Lastly, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And until next time, I'll see you later.